With entertainment content, we added back in the ITV, or the connected TV. And we looked at it by non-TV related entertainment versus TV related entertainment, because you can obviously do all sorts of things with these devices or with a connected TV. And not surprisingly, the biggest motivation is to entertain or amuse myself and relax and pass the time. So it's also not surprising that the screens with the bigger screens uh, or with the more real estate are gonna win here, whether that's the TV itself or the tablet or the PC, and especially for TV show related content, we see the utility that the phone brings dropping quite a bit. Tablets and TVs are a lot alike in that sense. They're both used while you're on the couch. They're both larger screens relative to other options that you might have, and they tend to fuel similar types of motivations, and we see tablet usage spike in prime time, similar to obviously what TV does. And we see this in our own, this is from the diaries, but we see this in our own internal log data as well. Uh, tablets are basically at-home devices. I think about 18% of tablets have cell plans enabled. And if you think about the way that most people commute, where they are, they're in a car, tablets have less, um, less of a role when you're commuting in most of the country. So people leave their tablets at home, they tend to use it while they're on their couch, while they're using TV. Among our sample, 61% said that they multitask while watching TV most of the time. My guess is that everybody in this room probably does this too, whether it's with a phone or a tablet. What are they doing? It's probably the same kinds of stuff that everyone here does. Simply browsing the internet, using social media, email, games, shopping, etc. The point here is, if I'm a TV advertiser, and I'm spending a ton of money to run TV spots, this actually terrifies me. Because what's happening is the ratings aren't being degraded. If you have the opportunity to see a TV spot because you're in the room, you'll be counted as a part of the ratings. As an advertiser, you're paying for that. The problem is, if your eyes aren't on your tablet or on your phone, by the time the spots come on, they certainly will be. So if you're an advertiser spending a lot on TV, the problem is you're paying for attention that's drastically degraded because there's all of these other things in the room to steal your eyes away from. And that's not being counted in the ratings yet. 